Now, most of these I have already. There's only three in Sarah Lake Caverns. There's only three. A swarm of moths is drawing near the central beacon, blocking the light we use to navigate. That's cool. Mount up and knock them from the skies. It's very close. It's like right here. Oh, wait a minute. There's a backpack here. Alright. Oh, here we go. It's right over here. Oh, <laughs> missed it. Yeah, I read this during the quest for Varaxian. For Varaxian. So they look like this. To witness the earth water shape the land and draw forth, forth the potent magma that will power his laboratory was inspiring to us all. The Jaradins seek to drive us out. But the dragon slayers stand alone and have no hope of victory. The master says a great war is coming, and that he alone can protect dragonkind. Until our queen can be convinced he is right, we must labor here in secret. By wing or by talon, we shall prevail. Ooh. Okay. This is related to the quest, but I'm, I'm not going to pick it up right now. I do have have a copy of it already, I think. Um, eh, why not? I'll just look at it. I think you could just read it. No, you get a copy of it. Yeah, it's related to um, note to disposal site. This note contains orders sent to the gaze of Notharian. The official site for subject disposal is platform leaders. We have procedures for a reason. They should be followed. The Abrus overseers do not want to see disposal occur in other locations, regardless of how convenient they are. So it's... If you know what happens in Abrus, you know, it's kind of like... Ugh. Anyway. So that's one. Which one was that? That was... Primal Power. So we're going to check out Binding Oaths. This one I think I remember someone that's by the, is near n that place that's hard to pronounce. Oh, research archers under fire is happening, but doing those them this days. I don't think I've done this weeks. Yeah, I did. These I, Titan I, devices were created to gather data and sorry, monitor their environs. See what knowledge you can glean from them while they do their thing. And sorry, Manon. No can do today. Here it is. Well, at last, we've reached these hidden halls. It's Nazkazol. Yeah, Nazkazol. 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 Oi. When at last we breached these hidden halls, the master was wroth. He remembered angry words about tears, many secrets. I judged it unwise to press him further. Then when we presented the artifact, we found his mood brightened. The ideal soldier never questions orders, he told us. The glove fits as though it had been made for him. Before long, the master returned to his experiments, heartened that he would soon succeed. This is where you go. With, um, Renan and crew and, um, Abyssian and Emberthal. Um, chasing Sarkareth and crew in there, and they find the um, they find the broken uh, glove of domination that you see in, in you you see it if you if you watch the um, uh, the cinematics for this expansion, the uh, three. 
um, the one that shows the point at which Neltharion fell. He's wearing, there's a whole thing about it. I, I'm not going to go into right now, but that's what that's referring to. All right, one more. Is there like ca caverns? I don't think, this one I don't think I have. This one is new. Um, it's called Demanding Perfection. Sorry. To hit. It's way at the other end. Huh. It's located here? I've been here a few times on other characters, including Arleia. To get, um, it's right here. To do the thing that opens up the chest in Abrus up here. If you kneel, it's not going to matter now because I already got it. But if you stand in front and you kneel. You'll see the eyes light up, and then it's going to breathe fire, or whatever the heck it is, obsidian dragons breathe, um, like some fire earth flame thing. But over here, I'm going to have to probably kill these guys. Yep. Is the stone. Alright, so what does the stone say? Ancient stones are set. Well, that's the achievement, but what does the stone say? Here we go. The master, master detailed his specifications as always. He expected perfection. We labored ceaselessly. We slept little. But, but duty and fear kept us moving apace. Overseer Ketheros. Ketheros? That's a blue dragon was called before the master or it's it's hard to tell dragon dragon can have different names over to Ketheros was called before the master one of the passageways had been carved smaller than designed he was told there was fire and screaming then i was promoted to overseer i will measure each passageway myself the master will have his laboratory as designed and now i'll return home to my broodmate in our whelplings I wonder how that turned out from. <laughs> um, that's also like going to the question of dragon society and broodmates and consorts and how that all works. Um, anyway, we're going to take a shortcut. Let's go back to Veldraken. So that's one. We got one. We got one down. I think Forbidden Reach has some. I may just do Forbidden Reach first. A lot of little things to do. Um, here we go. Ancient Stones of the Dragon Isles. I'm going to put tracking for this. Um, I can't tell what these say. 
Waking Shores, Onarum Plains, Ashespan, Valdrasis. Are there none in Forbidden Reach? Maybe not. So let's start Valdrasis since we're here. How many are there? Oh, I have two already, but we're going to look for them anyway. There's one in Valdrakum. There's one in Valdrakum. Since we're here, let's find that one first. It's like right over here. <laughs> You know why? Where is it? Ah, <laughs> there it is. Well, you know, I don't come up this way very often. I fly in, so it's hard to see. So what's this say? My beloved kin. It is here we have built a monument to our unity. Veldraken stands not just as a home, but an example of what draconic ingenuity and cooperation can create. Every dragon has put their mark on this place. They're both the magic of the through both the magic of their fight and their dedication to each other. From its heights, we can watch over the isle, isles and keep them under our care. We can gather and share what we have accomplished, ensuring that each new generation continues to grow and thrive. Veldraken is a place of harmony, of balance, and of the love that unites us. As you walk its paths and speak with your kin, let that love guide you let that love guide you. Together we flourish, Alex Straza. Oops. Can I clear the marker? Wow, it's. Alright. I'm trying to clear the mark. Alright, I'm just gonna clear it. Manually. Next one. Well, we're doing all of them, but I figured I was going to do the one that's in Valdrak at first. The next closest one is Mighty Ducks. Now, my cat has found a thing, which is good. It's it's some foam thing um, that she's using as a scratching post, which is great. If she's using that, she's not using furniture. Right. Mighty Ducks. Here. Is it underwater? Looks like it might be underwater. No. Oh, it looks like it's on this little island here. Okay. The noises this fish makes, it... <laughs> it's not a fish. Fish don't make noises like that. It sounds like some guy on reverb and with the reverb turned away going wee 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 wee. <laughs> and I'm like... <laughs> All right. 
to eat this dough. I came here to nap, as, of, as I often do, and found myself confronted by a very angry duck. What is it with the duck, Kate, in this expansion? <laughs> Upon closer inspection, it appears that she, I believe she is the mother, is guarding a clutch of eggs. After some soothing reassurances, she let me rest, but I found myself unable to doze off. Instead of observing the duck, the nest, and the eggs, she continued to watch me when she thought I was not looking, as if sizing me up. Despite her small stature, I believe she is more than capable of delivering a beating to anything that might threaten on our, our offspring. How very like a dragon! I suppose it matters little if an egg comes from a dragon or a duck. Fragile those shells may be, they hatch into mighty creatures, no matter their size. Mighty ducks. Quack, quack, quack. Cute little duck things. Little ducks. They are adorable. Don't mind me. So, I'll clear this. Remove a point. Right. Next closest. Well, it's kind of all over the place. So we'll start, we'll go north and head south. Well, we're close to the south. A timely message. This is going to take us to the bronze dragonfly area, and then we'll work north. Here we go. It's going to be a longer trip. Probably a message from No Dark No Stormy. Very close. Oh, it's right there. Okay. So it says a timely message. Timely message. Okay. Coral Dormy. Oh, haha! <laughs> Very funny. Look. I'm certain you think it is a marvelous prank, but if someone of the age, not of our own, finds those messages, they may learn of events and instances that should, they should not know about. Think about the temporal repercussions. You could be opening the way to, to paradox, and you know Father wouldn't be happy about that, would he? Also, it was my diary. I don't care when you took it. Bring it back. I don't want to know more about this story. <laughs> All right, that was fun. Next one is North. It was called Together Bound. They have mailboxes and yeah, they do. I need to I need to stop by and check check a mailbox. All right, onward. Some of the beasts that came through the time rifts here ended up in bad places, like these poor wee kitties. Not doing the kitties. Go on and save them. 
very tiny. Could be right here. Oh, great. Fell Lieutenant. I am clearly in a rift, I think. He promised. Alright. Sorry, he promised. I gotta read this tablet. I'm assuming they mean Illidan. Here we stand before... <laughs> I want to finish it without being attacked. Here we stand and here we gather beneath both wind and sky, joined as one forever, for one forever after, beheld by dragon eyes. Should any serve to break the bond that binds them strong and true, both tooth and claw of dragon kind shall dole them out their due. Soul to soul and heart to heart, they now live as on as one. Wing to wing, they take to skies. Their journey just begun. It sounds like, well, I mean, dragon wedding, dragon wedding vows. And it's a good spot. I, I've passed by the spot often too before, like, fell things started showing up. Fell Queen's Guide, fell. My guess is this is the uh, the future where the Legion won. Right. So next one is Keeper's Blessing. I didn't realize probably cheer hold I didn't realize um, the rifts went out this far but I guess so yeah I mean well I'm right there really not that far um, oh come on really now how many times I've been over here right here. This isn't your hold. It's by we forget killed you end up. To those who follow the Titan's path, no focus, no harmony. To those who honor the Titan's teachings, grant wisdom, grant strength. For those who fall from the Titan's grace, in the deep places we shall bind you. For those who betray the Titan's gifts will be broken and reforged anew. Titans are not good. <laughs> Titans are not good. Nothing's good. Uh, yeah. Okay. Right. I was trying to clear it by running over it, but let me move my point. Next one is Oh Guardian Wings. This one is by the Academy. I didn't I didn't get the code for it. It's a fun little thing to do this evening, I think. A nice little quiet thing. It's a little weird around this area. 
because there's multiple levels to every area. Oh. I might be underneath here. It might be the next level. Or I or I don't know where. Or a higher level. some of this up. It's going to send me to the same place. Oh, I see it. I see it. This one, Guardian Wings. There's one more though. I got it already. What I want to go back and read it. Guardian Wings. I know you are out there across the divide. I see you scanning the skies at night. I wonder what it is you search for. I would ask you directly, but I've been told not to approach. Rumors suggest you prefer to live in solitude. I will respect that. And I hope that your search, whatever it might be, proves fruitful. And I will keep my eyes set in your direction. Every now and again, just to reassure myself of your safety. We must look after one another, after all is the way of dragon kind. Hmm. Huh. I mean, maybe I'm reading it wrong, but it could mean that um, there was a dragon left behind. Want someone left to search. So someone either left and didn't come back. I, I don't know. I don't know who it is. I could be misinterpreting that. Anyway, the last one with Thaldrasis is called Caretaker's Notes. And it's in the ossuary. Well, I'm using all of Wildhead. Uh, I'm looking at their site with their map as well. I mean, honestly, if I wanted to, I could probably put a little mini window with it somewhere on here. Um, hmm. Man, I honestly could. I really could. But, uh, let's just do this. It's always raining here. But the thing, again, with the ossuary is it's a dragon graveyard. Dragon Blight, I believe, took over when they had to leave the Isles. But yeah, this is a dragon graveyard. They can die. They're not... The aspects are immortal. I don't think, even though they call you mortals all the time, we know from certain quest lines that they're not. That they are... They can die of old age. They can choose it, but they can die. Anyway. This place is downright melancholy. The skies are dark and gloomy no matter the time of day. They said I was here to learn responsibility, but I suspect they just put me here to dampen my spirits and make me behave like a proper dragon. Fine then. 
I will fulfill my task dutifully even. But they cannot stop me from having a bit of fun whilst carrying them out. Our dead should not have to spend their eternity wallowing in mournful tears. After all, they succeeded in the onerous task of, of living, did they not? I wonder if the wildlife here have the same magnetic attraction to my arcane sphere as the dead foliage that I gathered has. I bet that's worth an experiment. At the very least, I suspect any lingering ghosts we find will find the effort very amusing. Um, this caretaker notes the caretaker was Senegos. So this was written by Senegos. And that's why I had to come over and read it again out of respect. Um, and also out of respect, I think it's the one all the way on top. it's one of these two. No. Senegos. Bit of a spoil if you haven't done the Blue Dragon quest. Um, yeah. That's an excellent quest line. Um, you see it coming before it arrives. But when it does, especially if you play Legion, it's a lot. But it's, it's a good form of a lot. Not a bad form of a lot. So from here, we'll start doing Waking Shores and working ourselves. I don't think I have any in the Waking Shores. Any at all. But we'll start. Because we have a mission. Uh, the first is learn and grow. Which should be, I think it's over here somewhere. For some reason it's not putting the uh, markers on the map, but that's fine. Um, I just follow the arrow. At some point I gotta do the- oh, this area. This makes sense. Um, I l somehow miraculously accidentally landed on a tree branch. You know, I should have pretended I meant to do that. Because <laughs> I, like, flew right into it. It was perfect. Um, yeah, I meant to do that. That, that, wasn't, that wasn't purely a coincidence. Alright, let's go. I don't think I've ever went to any of these areas. Because I didn't feel like fighting. That's why. <laughs> There are a lot of- oh, oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> what the heck? I was like, oh, these are easy. They'll go down. And then they freaking kicked me. Oh. It's the, it's the freaking drag there, man. There, I gotta turn my back to a wall. Alright. So, they have a pushback. And that pushback nearly got me killed. And that wasn't fun. Alright, let's go inside here so anything that attacks me. Oh, come over here. Come over here. So there's a bird in here. There's no stone in here, but there's a bird in here. I think there is a thing for this. I think that's part of an achievement, but we'll just do that for now. Um, 
There is a like take a picture with certain birds thing. It's too far away. I'm out of range. Yeah, that's strong gust. Don't like I like it when I'm on a drag deer, but I don't like it when I'm not. So it wasn't in that one. I'm going flying right inside. They didn't even notice me. It's not in here. Nothing's in here. Alright. We can row because we're a rogue. It's right here in the middle. Right here. Really? I need to get closer. Fine. It's too far away. Okay. Can I thank you? Read in peace. Um I am no longer a student. Learn and grow. I am no longer a student. But I find myself returning here regardless. My days are spent guiding our young from shell to hatchling, safeguarding the precious generations to come. But my evenings are spent here. The sun is particularly beautiful from here. The stories we have captured enthralling, the art inspiring. Truly, this is a place in which we learn to mature our young. But it is also a place where we can nurture our own interests as well. Perhaps the Dragon Queen intended this all along. A sanctuary where we can continue to learn and grow no matter our age. This location, by the way, is on the Lifebinder Observatory. It's one of the few places that's completely in ruin. Well, not completely in ruin. Still remarkably preserved, given it's over 10,000 years old. But, but still... Like, it's at least lacking roofs in places. At least things are on the ground. You still have a bunch of neatly stacked books. Books. That in no way did the pages rot in all these years. Yes, we could just excuse it all. It's magic. Magic did it. Magic is responsible. They use magic to preserve, uh... To preserve... 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 Blah, blah, blah. Preserve books. Alright. The next one I mean it's kind of a zigzag. One, two, three, four. I'm gonna do the two near the Obsidian Citadel last. Um, this one is so close so far. I think I can actually just copy them all. <laughs> all right. So we got I should pick up more, more boomy, boomy sticks and, uh, boomy sticks. <laughs> Go the dragon's <laughs> boomy stick. Boom sticks. Um, dragon skill expedition, pick up more dynamite. Oh, here it is. It's right here. Okay. I, I ran by it about a million times, so it's right here. This one's so close so far. Shall I tell you why I watch the stars? It's a lot of squawking in the background. Shall I tell you why I watch the stars? They are distant. They keep me 
company, like memories of loved ones. The lives below cry with persistent noise and clamor, a sharp contrast to the silence of absent friends. When I meditate beneath the heavens, I imagine lines drawn between these distant points of life. Familiar faces all. Each new discovery I make is named for a loved one I have lost. These bright sparks lessen my grief. Atop the spires of my observatory, I may be quiet. I may be unattended, but I am never truly alone. Well, that's nice. Next one is welcoming the first. Though I did want to go to before I do that. I want to um, go back to the embassy. Or actually, I can just go back to the original, the landing point. Shouldn't take me too long. I'm just gonna zoom it. I think it's here. Yes, it's right on. Here. So I think you have to actually. Come, let us parlay. Emilia Bello. What are you doing here? Many of these statues are quite valuable, but in disrepair. We collect the pieces that break off and safeguard them from looters and souvenir hunters. If you find anything loose, pry it off and bring it to us. We'll keep it safe until a proper restoration effort can be undertaken. So I think this opens up finding certain treasures. Do check back for new stock, friend. Show me what you have for sale. I already have that. <laughs> Look, it's just, it's just, it's a, uh, it's purely cosmetic. Um, Come back any time. You got my attention. So I think that starts. I think you need that in order to collect certain gems that are part of like the the dig thing. Um, I, I, yeah, you know, what you use the shovels for the dirt piles. All right, now we'll go to where we should be going. I wasn't sure if I got that on our layer yet. And I wanted to be sure because I do want to finish that. There's two appearances that you need a soul bound gem on. And she hasn't find. It was Titan. I had to get it. You know, that's Hokum, but whatever. Um, oh, I forgot to shoot. I didn't overload it. Oh, okay. So even if you don't overload it before you pick. Titan Touch Portal. It's going to take me somewhere else now. Oh, good. It has a return portal because I was going to say. Sometimes, sometimes the return portal doesn't show up. All right. So where were we? I also need to visit. I also need to visit the um, the frog. I think I have enough to buy the sunglasses and start the art of thing. Okay. So, oh, right here. Oh, okay. When you first come to this one, there's a whole quest around it. Um, yelping some dragon can and um, it, it's it's a cute quest I don't want to ruin it but if you come here then when you read this it just says it looks like it's waiting for something I guess I can read it now 
Yep, I can read it now. Cool. The first whelp arrived in a, in, a, in a joyous display of ceremony. A parade of dragons gathered along the ivy-clad trellises to greet the young one. The egg belonged to a humble red dragon who supervised the temperature of our life pools. Who better to determine the right amount of heat than a mother? She gently breathed the fire until the ambience was just right. When the blessed moment came, she lovingly awaited her child, as, as did the gathered assembly. Silence surrounded her until the shell finally cracked. The tiny triumphant sound elicited a cheer from the gathered throng. Even now, the joyous display and echoes, the joyous display echoes in my heart. I remember the dragon queen bowing her head, tears in her eyes, not of sadness or sorrow, the joy of a purpose at last fulfilled. I mean, it assumes there were dragons before, but it, I, it's, I guess it's the first egg that hatched in the ruby life holes. I wonder if this was the mother. I wonder why it's by this dragon. The, they're flying around the circle. Well, I mean, that's that's just just freaking lovely. All right. The last two are at the Obsidian Citadel, and they're Nilthara Stands. I think I have read that one, and no, I didn't. I haven't read any of the not not on this character. And then one small part is another one, so. Um, Nathara Stance is the closer of the two. Yeah, Allegiance to One is up. It's like it's up. It, I haven't done it in months. Um, but it's up. So we're. So that will be something we get to hear. Wait, let me check something. Disturbed dirt. That's what I was like. The dirt stuff. The dirt stuff. I think I have enough shovels. Seven charges, 20. Yeah, we It's a lot of derbs, derb, 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 <laughs> That's it's here. Derby, derb, derb. Is that disturbed dirt too? Yep. Don't want to bother getting it. It's like, I'm right here. I don't see it. Oh, here it is. I got I got an appearance I already have. Awesome. <laughs> I can put it on um I can put it on the auction house. Let's see if there are any buyers for it. For the for the folks who don't do this. Alright. Oh, I didn't put in the I don't think I put it in yet, did I? Altharis stands. Zoradin continue to threaten our position here. The Black Dragonflight welcomes your help in repelling these attackers. Though I have been, perhaps, difficult at times, we've always worked together. I am sure you will continue to support my efforts for the betterment of Azeroth.
Uh, I'm like, why are these people? Why are there? Why is there a crowd here? And I realized, oh right, 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 right. The Mystic Keystone, Mythic Keystone is doing. And Neltharis is one of them. All right, so this stone here is Neltharis stance. Neltharis stance. Behold, the bulwark of the Dragon Isles, Neltharis. Any who would threaten the land of dragons will first have to contend with its finest defenses. Our numbers are great. Our weapons are greater still. Whether it be by claw, breath, or blade, our enemies will fall. Let this place serve as a warning and grave to any who would be mad enough to test our prowess. For this is our oath, to protect the deep places of the world, to protect the world itself, to protect our kin. We will see dragonkind prosper until our watchful eye, under our watchful eyes and warding wings. So that didn't work out originally, but they're, they're, they're trying to work on it now. They're trying to, trying to make up for it. Uh, remove waypoint. And this one should be the last one. This is um, one small part. And this will give us the achievement for the Waking Shores. Where's it? Okay, it's really close. Up there? Been there in a while, why not? Oh, I think I know exactly where it is, too. I think I know where it is. I've never clicked on it for so or I may have clicked on it when it still wasn't I was still wasn't able to read it when it, it still wasn't possible to read it and this is why I like being a rogue because I can do all kinds of roguey things and not have to fight and get into battles that kind of sucks so I can sneak around. I think I see the stone from here even. Sometimes there is um, a rare. And that would, have, that would have sucked. But it seems I am lucky. And the stone's right here. And yeah, I've seen the stone a million times. In doing the runs here. And this one's called One Small Part. And I should get the achievement. Alright. I only asked... Ooh. <laughs> okay. Goes right in it, doesn't. I only asked aloud about Father once. If the obsidian throne is his, why is he not here to rule from it? Had it been anyone else, I would have been cuffed for my impertinence. Instead, she only narrowed her eyes. One does not rule by sitting on a rock. But I have not seen him in months, I protested. You do not matter, she hissed. The flight is what matters. You are merely a small part of a greater whole. One that, she noted with another glare, is testing my patience. I no longer question. I do not wish to be I do not wish to displease him. One small part. Perhaps in due time I can be more. Now who it's re I mean we know it's referring to Neltharian. Um, but who is it from? It could be... I mean, it could be Sibelian, even. Um, but it could be Nefaris. It could be Anixia. It could be... You know, any, any of the dragons that he's a he was a direct father of? I don't think it's Abyssian. I think Abyssian is actually younger than the dragon. I think he was... I don't think he was born on the Dragon Isles. 
I'm not even sure Sibelian was. I hope at some point they actually bother to explain all this. How old these dragons are. Because it seems like Sibelian is older than Abyssin, but Abyssin I think is 10,000 years old? I don't know. In any case... Well. I meant to do this without getting into fight. I don't want to jinx myself though. But I had a feeling, I was like, I there's a stone down there. It, it's that one. And I've definitely tried to read it while doing the um, the key runs. To get the keys for the, um, the rep. But, um... But yeah. Oh, I didn't have, uh... I didn't bring, um... Oh, it doesn't matter. I've... I've... I've had... It's, she has no reaction whatsoever. Luciana. I was kind of hoping she would. Like, she'd be like, oh, cool. This is cool. And, like, just look around. I have stuff to say to, uh... The two toots on top. So... Waking Shores is done. Um, we are going to do Onarin Plains next. Onarin Plains, I guess we should start from the first Kronal. I actually... I actually... Okay, that this is not helpful. <laughs> Let's just do that. I was it, there was the option to it says copy all, so that's what I was going to do. But I'm just going to uh, do them each individually. Something I recently discovered. All right, here we go. And this one is called the first kunai, kernel, first kernel. My my chart's pronounced. Tira was the first kanamatra. Over her lifetime, the division of our people became more pronounced, threatening the tentative pact we made with the green ones. To prevent more division, she called the first kunal. In this, she did more than unite families, she united the clans. Those of the first Kunal were wary. The words they spoke to honor and celebrate were new. They had no ritual to follow. Like newborn foals, they teetered into the silence and filled it with ceremony. Each year, that ceremony was renewed. Leaders repeated old rituals and speeches, building tradition. The first Kunal now serves as a lesson for us all. Trust must begin somewhere, often with a single act. From one grandmother's trust and love, our union was made. That's cool. Next one. Um... Next nearest one is the Null Wars. And it's in a cave. Honestly, the Onara Plains is really one of the few places you can do it, right? It's in a cave. Here we go. There's a lot in here. There's only one you can read. Interesting. Okay. The Null Wars. 
When we first arrived in the Unarum Plains, we were not alone. Knowles lurked in the shadows, grinning with malice as I set their snares. Arahuna, soaring overhead, watched their migration. Unara's winds carried mocking laughter to us. When the children of Maruk and Tira first faced those foes, the gnolls tested their, their patience. They fought with fury and hatred, as if they had nothing to lose. Inevitably, we pushed, we pushed them from the plains. We lost many, but they lost more. But if you see a single knoll, be wary. Where there is one, there are always many more. Oh, I don't I know it. <laughs> Do not let them surround you. Drive them out. Show them there is no land, no prey, no room for their kind here. Yeah. Knolls and murlocs have the same annoying habit of, like, you will pull every single one. Um, so that one is the Knoll Wars. We're going to do Wind, Wood, Water next. I figured it was on this island. See, here it is. We have a Briskwater Otuk. <laughs> and just chilling out on this rock. And I should be able to read this. Or not? Why can't I read it? Oh, it's on this side. Okay. <laughs> it's like, it's right here. Wind, wood, water. Long ago, a grieving mother lost her only child. She followed his funeral procession to the eternal Kurgans. Distraught, she cried all day and all night beside his brut brutal, besides his burial mound until she collapsed in mourning. When she awoke, it was with surprise and shock for she was lying in the shade of a massive tree that had grown overnight, its bows outstretched to Inara's skies. Beside her, clear water had gathered in a, s in a small pond. The winds had carried her grief to the ancestors and touched them to respond with gifts to soothe her aching heart. This place endures here still. The shade and water offer comfort and solace to those that come to the Kurgans to grieve. Even in our deepest sorrow, we are never truly alone. That looks nice. Alright, next one. Dreams in Emerald. I found it. Yep, there it is. Not bad. Dreams in Emerald. The gardens first called to me in my dreams. In pleasant moments of light slumber, my mind wandered, envisioning the vast forests of the Emerald Dream. Isera sensed my fascination. Somnicus, she said, you will be the first caretaker of the garden. In ritual, I contemplated Ysera's portal between that languid realm and our own. I am no sage, no mage. My scales are green, not blue. Yet my mind showed me the way. 
revealing my path to the Emerald Dream. In the waking world, the seeds of a great forest sprouted and thrived and soon towered over the place where I dreamed. The trail I blazed has always been sacred to me. In the depths of my dreaming, the garden awaits. The gardens await. Somnicus. He's the, isn't he the old guy? The old one? I can look for him now, but I may pass him because the next one is in the same roundabout area. Which is called Your Dreamer. And this will round out Onarum Plains. Though I do need to find the Great Swag. I think he's over here somewhere. Which is not convenient. Which makes me think I should have done this in the other direction. Oh, I guess it's over here. I was like, I wonder if it's in that other area. That makes sense. Nope, it's not. It's over here. Theramus. Hey, Theramus. Have I spoken to you yet? All paths begin in the dream. It's good to see you, friend. The last one for the achievement, so here we go. Boom. What's no? I'm trying to read it. Theramus. I had hoped to leave word with you directly, but this will have to do. The aspects and I are needed elsewhere. For how long, I cannot say. Something threatens this world. Not even Malago seems to know exactly what we are facing. It seems in this we fly, we fly blind. Watch over this place, dear one. Keep it safe, both for the dream and for me. I'll return soon enough. Hopefully in time for the new bloom. We shall plant evermore together. Your dreamer. I mean, it does beg the question of, was, did he stay behind? Huh, it has, a, and I've opened this ancient way gate up, but did I bother to go inside the tower? There's a topper level of the tower. Apparently. Oh, there it is. Silly. All right. So here we go. Back throws maintenance. A note to all guards in attendance. Although perhaps my finest work to date, back throws is also the most delicate. Due to the nature of the enchantments providing to reinforce the nearby vault, the tower has been keyed to every major ley line in the Azure Span. While ingenious, this does pose a considerable amount of risk. If there are any signs of structural or arcane damage to the tower, report to me immediately. Should you fail to do so well, I suppose you would not survive long enough to regret that decision. Malagos. I mean, it definitely looks like something went wrong here. But it was attuned to every major ley line in the Azure Span. I mean, but that came up during the um, the zone main quest. But... So, next... These next ones are near each other. The last one's actually near Iskara. Um, the Val. Which is in a cave.
Wow, I am streaming longer than I thought I would doing this. This is good. It's kind of a slow, slow chill kind of thing. With a little tour of the, uh, mini tour of the, uh, the Dragon Isles. This one's called the Val. It's in a cave. Not to be mixed up with certain short stories. But certain black dragons. Because this can't have anything to do with it. Whoa, what did I just do? Alright. It's definitely here. Um, but I have to kill something first. I just want to make sure. This is not going to be a big deal. This, I'm, I'm not worried about the enemy. I just wanted to make sure that I'm wasting my time doing this. I'm, I'm not wasting my time doing this, so this is where I need to be. So, it's actually a little odd. I don't think I need to be in the cave. Nope, yeah, I do. Alright, so, <laughs> what are you going to do this the rogue way? And then we go. So, the vow. The blue one apologized for the actions of her kind. She has promised us that they will abandon their camp and leave our land. She, ha she has also offered the aid of her people, should we need. I have turned her away. Why would we trust her so readily when our, wor when our words were ignored until our spears joined the speaking? Let it be known, her word has been given. We have been told that this vow is unbreakable. Should any of our kind encroach on our land again, her word is nothing, and we will take action. Wonder who's saying this. I mean, the major folks in this area. Well, there's Furbog. It could be Furbog. Um, it could be Furbog. It could be Tuscar. It's close enough. Now it's pretty far from the Onaran Plains, so. I'm going to tuck myself over here and get the next one. And the next one is a little further south. Attention! Immediate evacuation. Okay. Let's see what this is about. Wow, there's two. Okay, keep going. Keep going. Get away from me. I don't feel like fighting you. of Carthar. Car there it is. So I'm in the ruins of Carthar. Attention! Immediate evacuation. By order of the spellkeeper, all work herein is me will immediately cease, and all dragons must evacuate the area. As you know, our efforts here, while well-intentioned, have attracted the ire of the nearby Furbar camp. Despite the necessity of this facility, as well as our offers of protection, the Furbog insist on being left alone in the most violent of fashion. So yeah, it was a Furbog. Um, this, this, this goes along with the one we just read. I did my best to present our case to Our Lady, but her word is final. Our work here will remain unfinished. However, it will not be wasted. We are to relocate to the northeast. I have been assured that the new location is free of any potential disturbances. Gather your research and assemble there. I wonder it was who who made the pro who made the vow. There's some ride bark over there. I gotta get that, of course. Um, so the next closest one is Imbunada's blessing. The 
gonna get this right though, I thought. I'm surprised there wasn't one in the Ezra archives. I'm just surprised by that. Shoot. It's gotta be in a frickin' elite area, don't it? Alright. Next to an elite and things right over here too. Mother frick. Alright, we may have to take some precautionary measures here. Sap you. Okay. Imbunado's blessing. After we made camp in our new home, Kutik put his ball of could put his pole and bait to good use. Instead of our evening meal, the rivers brought an ancient one. What are you doing in my waters? she said. Critique is so tall and strong. Your waters are overrun with fish. Unless we feed on them, they will soon choke the river. You seek balance, the ancient one observed. Always, he replied. Then stay, settle, keep my waters in balance and I will protect you. In this, Imbu was born. Name, named for her, Imbunada. We protect her waters, and she provides us. And she provides for us. It is our way. Right, over here. Well, now what I'm going to do before I do that. Yes, I do want to remove all waypoints. I didn't, whichever one is. This one is, this last one is a solid foundation. And if I'm right, unless I completely forgot a zone in Dragon Isles, <laughs> that has, I thought the Forbidden Reach had them, but I guess not. Um, this will also be for the full achieve. So you got to go to all the way to the other end. By the Biascara. We can stay along the coast, though, actually. I haven't checked out the, um, revamped areas in Kalimdor where they've added um, fog and smoke and atmospherics rare occasion I can actually take my hand off the mouse while dragon riding I can't wait to do that in, in the in like Kalimdor and Eastern Kingdom. Shoot, <laughs> that was in Ascara, but apparently not. It's a little further. What in Whaler's Nook? 
I don't think I've spent much time here at all. Huh. Pick up some of those Tuscar boxes. Why not? Um, there's here's the last stone. It's the last stone here. Whaler's Nook. Whaler's Nook. Here. This should be everything. Let's see. Yep. Ancient Stones of the Dragon Isles. I don't get a title or anything for it, I don't think, do I? Um, no. No. That doesn't matter. Alright. After years of searching for a suitable location, I am proud to mark the founding of Whaler's Nook. May Graal bless our nets and spears with plenty. Together we will build the finest fishing hold this side of Azure Span, and soon enough, Iskara herself will be green with envy at our prosperity. Ha! A note has been scrawled beneath the text. Turns out the only green thing around here are the Gorlocks. Well done, brother. A note has been scrawled beneath the note. If your spear were half as sharp as your mouth, perhaps it wouldn't be a problem. The spirited exchange continues for several paragraphs. I think that's a great spot to uh, to end this this this, uh, this achievement on. Um, I think it's 